Sounds interesting. What's this? The the Steven. Oh, let me show it to you. <laughs> Fresh this morning. Oh, um, no, not for me. Uh, for the wife, and I'll I'll just stick with my Betty. Okay. <laughs> oh, maybe I'll have a double. <laughs> the amniocentesis test, you're going to have a perfectly healthy baby boy. Oh. A boy? You can already determine the baby's sex? Oh, that's easy. Our tests are really advanced. We'll oh. call him Andrew. Now, Andrew, we both agree that if a baby's a boy, we'll call him Michael. Chuck. Chuck? You have to call him Chuck. Why? Well, according to the Steinbrenner test, he'll be very athletic and... Chuck sounds like a good jock name. You can tell what kind of interests he'll have. That sort of takes the fun out of it. Yeah. Although Duke might be a better name. Why? Well, according to the Delaney test, when your son turns 18, he'll join the Hells Angels and he'll marry a pregnant chippy and get trapped in a loveless marriage. What of this? No. Though in reality, her child will be the son of Alonzo Mutego, a local bongo player. When your son discovers the truth about his wife, he'll hunt Mutega down, finally catching up to him in a rundown bar in the Philippines. A night fight ensues. Mutega will lie dead. Your son staggers out with severe facial scars. He'll escape the local police, swim to a tramp steamer, work his way back to San Francisco, and live out his years as a retired hairdresser in... Regina. <laughs> Doctor, not Regina. Now, these tests aren't 100% accurate. Oh. Oh, oh. <sighs> Excuse me, House, I'm looking for a tent. You're a tent? I don't believe it. You look fabulous, really. You know, the president would be proud to have you as a White House. And I'm not just saying that. You look great, especially this, uh, can't... No, 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 no. This feels like silk. This has got to be silk. That's fantastic. These ropes of yours? These ropes are a really nice touch. And, and these pegs? These are great pegs. Love those pegs. Can't say enough about those pegs. You have just redefined pegs for me. I really mean that. And I'm not just saying that so you let me climb inside you. I really mean it. Come on, babe. Give us a hug! <laughs> Are you finished with this part of the paper? No. Oh. I guess you're enjoying all the dirty words in there. Dirty words? Well, there are no dirty words in the Gazette. Sure, look at that. Rain predicted for some areas. Well, there's nothing dirty about that. Areas? That's a dirty word. No, it's not. It is if you say it right. 
nothing wrong with that. Group urges? Oh boy, government in action. Urges. Group urges. I have urges in my area. Urge isn't being used that way. Mine is. a woman who is so vivacious, enchanting, intelligent. Oh, Gil, I'm so glad you appreciate my intelligence. You know, most men can't handle dating a woman who's more intelligent than they are. Well, I... more intelligent. It's awful to think having brains is a burden. More intelligent? Well, <laughs> I'm not saying I'm a genius. But you are more intelligent than I am. Oh, I'm so glad you understand. You don't honestly think you're more intelligent than me. Oh, no, not you too, Gil. Well, it, it hardly seems fair to assume that you're... Let's not spoil the evening. After all, you just said I was more intelligent. <laughs> I said you were intelligent. I, I never said more. Are you saying that you're more intelligent than I am? No, I never said that, Claire. <laughs> then we're of the exact same intelligence. N no, not the exact same. Then one of us must be more intelligent. Well, it's impossible to judge who's smarter. Not for me, which proves I'm more intelligent. That's not proof. Look, I have a master's degree in psychology. Now, I don't make a big deal. I have a PhD in physics. My point is, it doesn't make any difference. Education is no measure of intelligence. IQ is. So what's your IQ? 133. I was highest in my class. I'm 165, so you can see why most men... Wait, 165 is genius IQ. You said you weren't a genius. Gil, I thought you were mature enough to handle this. I made a mistake. Geniuses don't make mistakes. Look, if you can't accept the fact that I am more intelligent than you are, this date is off. You are not more intelligent than me, and this date is off. Good night. <laughs> God, I hate women who are more intelligent than I am! <laughs> if you think our trip was exciting, wait till you see what we brought back for you. Home decor for 20 to 60% less every day. New arrivals every week. Coda, a boy's seeing eyes. Brought to you by Yukonuba. To learn how to analyze everyday situations and make life-saving decisions, this black lab needed the proper nutrition as she grew, which is why puppies like her should be nourished with Yukonuba, containing high levels of the brain-building nutrient DHA, shown to promote smarter, more trainable puppies in a study of pups and mothers fed enhanced Yukonuba. Coda's gotta have brains to be my eyes. Yukonuba, what healthy puppies are made of. The sub-freezing technology used by dermatologists to freeze off warts is now available in new Compound W Freeze Off. Now removing warts is so fast. Thanks, Mom. That was easy. New Compound W Freeze Off, the method professionals use. For red eyes, try clear eyes. It removes redness and soothes and moisturizes. Cool. The difference is clear, clear eyes. When I'm sleeping, that's a whole different story. I just don't feel it coming. It's when I start dreaming of lakes and rivers and ponds. I'm not going to wet my bed. I'm not going to wet my bed. And it won't happen. It won't happen. And I try not to drink water. My dad wet the bed till he was 12, so it might be genetics. Why it's not your fault and other truths at goodnights.com.
you're just going to have to deal with it, and you're just going to say, I'm not going to let it control my life. Here's to people who are proudly old-fashioned, at least where it matters. People who have always taken that extra little bit of trouble to deliver a taste no one else could duplicate. Here's to using good, honest ingredients, the kind we'd want to serve to our own families. And finally, here's to JM, who always said it best. You can taste the difference quality makes. What do you call color so rich you can feel it? New Hydrants. It now saturates hair before, during, and after you color. For color so luscious you can't help but touch it. New Hydrants. Color so rich you can feel it. From Clairol. Wherever germs hide, One. kids will find them. Trust Mr. Clean to kill 99.9% .9 of germs. Mr. Clean. If you can't wait to see what we brought back for you, here's a little taste. Home decor for 20 to 60% less every day. New arrivals every week. Jason Mahooch, master of disguises. See Jason ingeniously disguised as a door? <laughs> Fooled him, Jason. <laughs> Need a garbage bin to throw that Kleenex in? Oh, no, it's Jason again. <laughs> Jason, the air conditioning unit. Don't you feel cooler just looking at it? <laughs> Can you tell which is the real coffee machine? Taste won't give Jason away. <laughs> That's a lovely mink stole man. Touchy. Oops, oh, it's yes, Jason. <laughs> Isn't it amazing what they can do with Teflon? Wait a minute. That's no frying pan. Isn't that Jason? There's Jason again, right on time. <laughs> extra, extra, read all about it. Somebody else fooled by Jason. <laughs> Jason Mahooch, the human chameleon. One unemployed man who isn't going to waste his days just sitting around. Not good, not good at all. Excuse me, sir. A point of logic? If Derbyfield is absent, how is it that you're able to converse with him about his absence? It's illogical. Illogical? Yes, sir. Explain. Well, sir, every day you ask who is here, and everyone who is here says so.